side, front line, south side. I've been losing friends and finding peace. Honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me. Yeah, 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 yeah we pay. Yeah, 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 we pay. Yo, what up, YouTube? It's your boy from Everyday Trip, and we are here at Saddle Ranch for today's video. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Saddle Ranch is a fun hip spot located in West Hollywood. Saddle Ranch is mostly known for the Mechanical Bull. The Mechanical Bull is located inside Saddle Ranch. If you're feeling confident enough, you can go up to the manager and ask him to let you take the bull for a spin. Or you can sit back and relax, eat some good food, have some drinks, watch some sports, and you can watch someone take the bull for a spin and probably wipe out. That's enough talking about the bull. Let's make our way to the entrance and get on inside, get some of this food, and see what this bull has to offer. It sound right, boy. Here we go folks, this is the menu at Saddle Ranch. The menu isn't too bad, I have a decent selection from chicken, burgers, other sandwiches, ribs, tacos, and of course you have your alcoholic beverages. To see what we got, hold tight, it'll be just a second. Take a look.
this is the floor when we attended Saddle Ranch. It was about three, maybe four o'clock. There was a game about to come on. I forget who was playing. We thought it was gonna be a little more packed, but it actually wasn't, which was kind of cool. I also ended up getting some nighttime shots after the Team Pain concert. So be ready for that. This is what we ordered here. We had some of the buffalo wings with some potato skins. The buffalo wings at Saddle Ranch were exactly what I expected. I expected to be getting a typical sports bar chicken wing and that's exactly what it was. Same thing goes for the potato skins, I didn't expect anything special. Just a typical potato skin, that's exactly what we got. So don't expect anything too fancy when you go to Saddle Ranch and order this. It is good nonetheless, I'll give it about a 6 out of 10, that's on a good day. Right here we have the baby back ribs, came with some fries and we also got the house salad. House salad was good. Baby back ribs were amazing, and those fries that you see were pretty bad. I haven't had fries that bad in a while, actually I was very disappointed with Saddle Ranch. All in all, I'll be giving this salad a 5 out of 10, being generous. I'll be giving those baby back ribs a 9 out of 10. Very delicious, smacked it out the park with that one, and those fries will be getting a 3 out of 10 for me today. Those fries were uncooked, they tasted horrible. I need to dip them things in some grease for a little bit and then put them on my plate, for real. This next clip you're gonna be seeing on screen is a shot from me attending Saddle Ranch two days prior to the first half of this video. It was after the T-Pain concert, there'll be a link on screen. Got some tacos, some rice, and you know how to get them ribs again and instead of those fries, I had to switch it up with some tater tots and some veggies. And you know I can't end the video without a ball rider. Here we go. Can't you do it? Let's see. everyone that is going to be it from me at Saddle Ranch today there will be another part from Saddle Ranch it will be a part two in the very near future make sure you guys are subscribed and ready for that make sure you drop a like on today's video if you have not already we have just came back from our Las Vegas trip I didn't care <laughs> would you there will be a link on screen to my previous videos in Vegas, but make sure you guys are staying up to date with the channel because there will be multiple videos dropping from Las Vegas and other videos on this channel such as the NLE Chopper video as well as food reviews, unboxings, and more. So make sure you guys are subscribed. Do not forget. Make sure you do it before you click off this video because there will be a lot of content dropping in the upcoming days and weeks. That's going to be it for me today. I'll catch you guys in the next one.